today we will make the tastiest mushrooms ever. These are good not just for vegans or raw vegans or whatever. They're good for anyone. Anyone who has tasted them, they just love them. So no matter if you're a meat eater, you eat raw, you eat vegetarian, you eat cooked, you will love them, I promise you. It's They're very, very simple. Uh, the preparation is literally five minutes and um, then we'll see. So let's start. So these mushrooms um, are going to be raw but uh, we will not consume them straight away. So the smaller mushrooms you select the the faster and easier they will be ready and it, they'll be more tasty so you want to chop them very fine so they get very soft and nice and we'll just throw them in a bowl I have also here one spring green onion. You can put as much as you want depending on the quantity of mushrooms. If you like more onion, just put more. We usually like a lot of onion, but today I'm going to use this recipe as uh, an ingredient to another recipe, which I'm going to make a video later on gonna be something that I'm gonna be making for the first time but I think it's going to be absolutely supreme so to cut green onions it's not necessarily to be fine just cut them whatever sizes you, you like because they want to keep the onion a little crunchy we're not cooking them so it will be crunchy anyways, a little bit, but if you leave bigger chunks, it will be even more crunchy. You can make that with old onion, this recipe. It's not necessarily to be green onion, it's just what we have right now. So the next, I'm going to put a few bay leaves. They're from the garden of Anders' mom. Nothing is treated here in our gardens, and I have some fresh thyme from our garden. I'm just gonna throw this in. So technically these are the only spices that we need. Just thyme. You can use dry thyme. Most of the times I use dry but now I have fresh so I'm just gonna use the fresh. Super tasty like that. And then so that the mushrooms can become tender what we need to add is um, so for today's um, mushrooms I have selected flower salt which is the the, uh, the top layer of sea salt when they uh, prepare it and um, uh, it contains less sodium than uh, regular uh, sea salt Plus, uh, it's much more nutritive. The thing is that it gets destroyed if it's cooked. But because our dish today is raw, we can use it. And it's going to be supremely tasty. I'm just going to add some salt. Not too much. Because uh, we don't want it too salty. But depending on your taste, you can put more if you would like. You can use other spices as well. Um, for example, garlic, but I find garlic a little bit too strong for uh, this dish, so I don't use garlic. And then I'm just gonna add coconut oil. We use um, extra virgin coconut oil. This one is super tasty. 
can use whatever uh, virgin oil you would like but with coconut oil the taste becomes amazing it's like they're cooked in butter you have to experience that I cannot explain it <laughs> you can uh, use olive oil I usually make a combination between olive oil and coconut oil but at the moment it has finished it just finished last night so I'm just gonna use coconut oil don't be afraid to use coconut oil because it's fat which will not make you fat just the opposite it helps to lose weight and um, it's very good for many diseases um, you will love it and then I just mix everything and we have this and now I'm just going to put a cover on top of this so that we don't get any bugs or anything like this because I'm going to put it outside in the sun. And uh, then we'll come back in a couple of hours and I'm going to show you the final product. Hey again! Hello! So, <laughs> <laughs> our mushrooms are ready. We are going to eat Noel. And uh, we just wanted to show you the finished product. I added in the meanwhile a little bit of olive oil because uh, we went shopping and we bought some very nice good quality Portuguese olive oil. This is the best olive oil in the world. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, it's much tastier like this, it's amazing. Yes. Everything gets infused. It's super tasty. Try it and um, you will love it. <laughs> We love you. <laughs> no, Scott. Until next time. <laughs> ciao, ciao.